that Gary had his afternoon snack, it was time to save the world, one cow at a time. Look at the nature we're in. Look at the environment. Look at the neighborhood. It is a really cool place. Okay, we're going to do something here about the stopping of cow flatulence. This is methane that goes in the air. As I told you, when 200 cows fart, 400 cows fart, it'll cover these mountains with fog. Gas fog, methane. Is it that big of a problem in the world, cows farting? It can be. I guess when you add it up, right? When you add it up, yeah. Yeah. Sure. We're going to go in here, and here's what we're going to do. We are USDA inspectors. I want you to talk to the farmer about his personality reflections with cows. What I'm going to do when you're talking to the farmer, uh -huh. I'm going to take these corks. What? And I'm going to jam them in the butt of the cow so they can't fart. And what they'll do, their fart stops right before it goes out of their anus, and it goes back through their respiratory system, and it comes out their nose. Have you done this before? No. Oh. Okay, but go I ahead. I'm sorry, through. go ahead. I've read a lot about cow study. Hey! Hey! Hello. hey. We're with Hello. the USDA Hi. Government Hello. Inspection Foundation. With which? USDA huh? Government Inspection Foundation for Wild Stock. My name's Tom. I'm agent number two. This is Billy. I'm Billy. Agent number one. What the hell are you doing here? What's up? So much to my stay there. We're looking out for you and your livestock. We're here to talk as about well cows. As well well, my cows are fine. What the hell do you want to look at them for? We're inspecting your cows for your sake and for the cow's sake. Otherwise, you'll be fined $100,000. I want to talk to you about what makes a cow a cow. What's the most important part of it? I'll be out cow? here, Adam. Okay. The milk, of course. What uh, the hell do you think? I don't know. I don't know anything about cows. Do you like long horned cows? Do you like a, a Jersey mm. cows? I'm not going to tell you anything. Get out of here. You, you get out of here. Do you enjoy a television? Yes, yeah, sir. Um, What's your favorite program? Well, I like uh, JAG. Now we're talking. I like JAG too. Okay, okay, it's like okay, a, it's like the Magnum okay. PI of the nineties. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So. Uh, okay. Uh, like, here's a question I have for you. Uh, what do you do to make your cow so beautiful? Is there a trick? Is there a certain food you use? Well, we do use a regular feed. You know. Right. Right. Very carefully. Okay. Fantastic. What kind of cows do you? Uh, do? Wow, this is a nice house. Did you make it? No, I bought it from somebody when I got the cows over here. Were you a, like kind of a drifter and then bought a farm and? Oh, I grew here. up on a farm. Oh, you grew up on a farm. Good oh, Lord, why don't you get the hell out of here? I'm <laughs> up. All right, all right. I'm just, uh, I'm, you know what? I'm going to be. What's he doing? I, 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 I don't know. I, Let I, me go out. No, no you know what? Stay doing. here. I'm going to go check out. I'm going to go check out what the hell he's doing. What do you mean? Stay here. I'm going to check it out. I, I, I'm not going to let him go out there. I don't know what he's doing out there. Gary, what Gary. What the hell are you doing Gary, out there? I can't, I can't stall that guy anymore. I hope you didn't do anything to that cow. No, not at all. He's butt plugged. Okay. I have another question about cows. Can, have you ever made it a cow with a horse? God. No. Okay. I want to. No, I'm going to tell you a little secret. There, there is going to be, and I, I don't want to release Good this because this is Good kind bossy. of for the fall. Good bossy. A cow horse. Imagine an animal that can give you milk and then plow a hundred yards of field. I know I've heard about cross breeding, but I never thought about that. We're, we're thinking about the farmer, and uh, could you just second, hold a second? I just want to talk to him. I want to ask him one bit of information, okay. then I can tell you about human cow cloning uh, next step hey are you done are you done i forgot to bring vaseline it doesn't go in the rump of the cows as smooth as i thought it would okay so we're done yeah all right i'm gonna thank you we're done Ooh. we we fantastic cows thank, thank, thank you. you very thank much thank you very much sir we'll be back in three months to yeah. inspect again oh, okay right now never. your cows are in good shape yeah uh, what do you know all right your cows are in good shape okay That's pretty interesting we'll Jeez. butt plug them later ah. Okay, this is not a failed mission. No, this is a failed mission. Shut up. This is not. We're in the middle of nowhere again, just like in you Sedona. Couldn't, you, couldn't, you, couldn't, you couldn't hold him. So what are we going to do now? <sighs> you can't compete with the energy of the neighborhood. That means your body. That means your mind. That means your focus. Because that is your environment. Right now, I learned something that I'm never to do. Always bring Vaseline when you're corking cows. <laughs> We screwed this up because we're in the middle of nowhere again. We got nothing accomplished. Get we're out here to learn. Hey, hey, he's coming. Mine. He's coming. He's coming. Let's keep going. Let's keep moving. Yeah, can we help you? Get the hell off the Okay, let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Gary, it. come on, Gary, Gary, Gary. Our job is done. Let's get on the bike and let's go. We're not using the bike. Why are we not using the bike? Because I gave it to an orphanage. And the great thing about your neighborhood and your environment is we use our legs to walk through the neighborhood and the environment because of the Legs are part of our neighborhood. 